and now let me go to the home fragment the java code and now we are within this init views we have to map the views of xml within this uh, java code so this method is uh, made for that purpose only that init code and now what i gonna do is to first get that uh, view pager mapped okay then we have our dot uh, id and its id is view pager home okay fine now we have that uh, linear layout so doing the same for the linear layout also ln points home and then okay so there is one error i gonna resolve this soon okay and now what i gonna do is actually we have uh, this function in it view wrongly initialized that that place we have to do it within that on create view method so we're gonna do it here so first of all what we need uh, we need a view here to pass within that function okay so this view is we have to initialized so now what i gonna do is to view view equals and then inflator dot uh, inflate then we have to get that uh, uh, fragment and then container and make that as to root false okay then here we have to remove this line and return view only so remove this and write view okay that's perfect no issues right now as you can see on your screens let me do this here like setup view pager so we have to make a function for that so that uh, the banners can be uh, move to show you offers okay so it's just like that so here we have this and now we have offer list dot uh, sorry offer list first we have to initialize this by making new array list and then we have to do dot add and we gonna add the images from the drivable it's like jsi and then jse1 to it's not i it's e so let me make uh, corrections to it okay okay add it successfully now what we gonna do is to just take that uh, home let's see okay so first we have to make an adapter for that so right click new and then java class here we need home view pager adapter okay so we created this uh, adapter and then we gonna use it here to pass this offer list to this uh, adapter so that it can be visible to the banner okay now we have this context and then offer list gain let me check it okay view pager dot set adapter and we have to pass the view pager adapter to it and then we have to do it like this add bottom dots and pass zero to it so whenever you see a banner you see just like uh, dots like three dots and then images moves from uh, left to right so just like that to show you that offer banner now we have to add the bottom dots actually so here we gonna add them current page and then we have to complete this uh, method like we have to add text view array and alt plus enter to import this first of all so just do this thing and now we have a text dot equals to new text view 
here we have to pass up the size text of a list dot uh, uh, size for it and then we have the linear layout and we call that remove all views from it and then we gonna run a loop here from 0 to the length of m dot text okay and then what i gonna do here is to pass i to it and then new and text view and then context we have to pass out then m dot i and dot uh, set text and within the set text we have to pass html dot from html and then source and we gonna use m percent has a two 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 six okay this is that uh, thing that uh, dot actually and then m dot i dot uh, set text size so here we pass out the size and size is 35 so that thing is a dot and that dot size is uh, you know made uh, greater than by the size uh, 35 yeah so let me take it within this float it's no issue it's uh, automatic typecast okay so now I'm dot uh, I turn here we gonna use a method set text color so that uh, gray color so get uh, resources we have get resources dot uh, get color and then we have our dot color dot then we have that uh, darker I think gray yeah so we have gray 400 it's better for this awesome now it's uh, almost done linear layout dot uh, add views and then we gonna pass this m text dot to it okay so uh, this method is completed let me remove this point automatic typecast will be there so we don't need that okay so for now make it 200 or 400 it's your choice okay if i make a 400 then it's a uh, pretty darker if you want it uh, lighter then you can choose of your size okay then we have uh, if condition if uh, m text dot uh, length is greater than zero then what we gonna do is current page and then dot uh, set text color the same thing and here we have get color then r dot uh, id let me take it out r dot color r dot color dot we have a uh, gray uh, let's take the gray as 400 and make that upper one is 200 okay uh, yeah 300 okay done now remove this extra space there is lots of extra space here so i'm gonna remove this all and then after this uh, curly brace you have to take up uh, one more method and that uh, method is on detach okay so in this method you have to just uh, go with the timer timer dot cancel okay so timer is also meant for this view page uh, for showing the offer banners okay and now i'm gonna scrolling it over here and within this uh, function we're gonna do view pager dot uh, add on page change listener than new page we have a new space then we gonna choose on page change listener okay then we have these three pre-implemented methods we have to work over them okay now what i gonna do is let me see it first of all pass out the position to it add bottom dot and then 
position okay then we have the timer and to the timer we have to initialize the timer also here so I gonna initialize the timer here and then we have to pass up new timer task and then run method get activity dot run on UI thread then new runnable let me take it like this and then this arrow okay now what I gonna do here is to make a if condition like if count we have count also within this so using the count here and now count is uh, like 5 less than equals to 5 then what we gonna do view pager dot set uh, current item then pass out the count to it okay so it is for moving your uh, banner offer okay that image will be moved around uh, time scale then we have count equals to 0 and again view pager dot uh, set current item pass out the count to it okay so everything is good till now but there are errors so we are gonna resolve these errors let me do it add this and then here we have to change few things give the time actually so after half second the image should be moved okay sorry it's uh, yeah so time period is two seconds then a delay is half second yes it's done three errors are there okay so this is the mistake that we have uh, make it we have to pass out the array element and we have done it with okay again we have put two errors these errors are because of the adapter that we gonna create right now so let me create or complete the adapter function class okay so we have this adapter class and it should be extends by pager adapter and then when we have a related problem but we have to implement uh, such methods to it let me do it correctly okay no issues implemented these methods Again, we have this okay this is the constructor problem I'm gonna resolve soon yeah and now we have to make like context and the another one is private then we have array list and array list of type like integer actually we gonna get the images from the driver and the, those have IDs and integer alt plus enter to import and then again alt plus insert then constructor and generated this constructor or you can type this okay and now you can see that I have to remove this I hope you are not getting this I am getting this because I have updated so I just gonna remove this line okay and it appears at two three more places so I'll use this replace and replace them by space so it's gonna remove it okay no errors right there you can see that and now to like return view equals equals to object okay so this is view pager from object and then we have this method initiate item remove this again this appears to be little blurry yeah and now what I gonna do here is to make a view equals to layout then inflator dot from context and then dot uh, inflate 
and we have to pass out r dot uh, layout dot what yeah uh, we have to create item for this actually we haven't created item layout yet so we gonna create it right now for item layout part done for that offer actually okay so i'm just importing but it is showing error because we haven't created so we'll go with the trad bulb and create layout resource file click on ok this will be created and we have to design this now you can see that so get this like this and then we have to pass out that the container and false to attach to root okay then we have image view but uh, we haven't given the, the property yet so it can show error yeah because we haven't anything to you know map with because uh, the item layout is created yet not yet designed so i have left this r dot id dot only i'll complete it okay set image resource of all this dot get position okay and then we have container dot uh, add view and pass out the view to it then we have return view okay no issues here also you can see yeah again what i gonna do here is to remove that of all this size return return the offer list size from here okay so this adapter work is completed we need a function here called destroy item so we like that uh, to remove it all the time this is pathetic again this appears to be the second place also okay so within this on destroy what we gonna do is view view then we have this uh, view object and then what I gonna do next is to container dot uh, remove view and pass out the view to it okay no issues everything is fine one error is there and this error is because of we haven't uh, worked on that item layout offer now we have to start work on it split it and now we have to just replace this constraint layout by linear layout okay and make it hide to wrap content Again, we have to give some properties like orientation should be horizontal remove this line and then place this line instead of that and then we have uh, image view here match parent wrap content and then we have like scale type so giving the scale type as center crop okay then we have the gravity as center again let me see what else we need it here we have to give the id for this because of that it was uh, causing the error in the adapter so given that id contain zone and uh, now i have to just uh, place it here r dot i dot contain job so yeah good to go one error unreachable statement okay so remove this line yeah no errors error free adapter go to fragment back and then completed you can see that it is also error free if you have messed up at anywhere then pause the video and correct the code okay now we have to move further so we gonna move on